<laughs> hey, good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Oh, oh look, Logan is oh, here he to say happy Wednesday too. Logan says hi. He's very, he's very, very excited. I'm laughing because yeah, he just put his wet nose in the middle <laughs> of my glasses right before we hit go. Well, good morning and welcome. <laughs> Uh, Moto, hey, you know, you don't have to stay a uh, mod. I can take you off of that. That yeah. just it just stays on from from yesterday from yesterday. Yeah, no one so, has official jobs, but we yeah. appreciate your help. That yeah, was a absolutely. huge help yesterday. Thanks. Uh, so hey, so we just wanted to start it off saying hi, everybody. How's it going? Um, we have gotten a little bit of uh, uh, some things to share. Uh, with you, so we know uh, yesterday we announced that we launched our Patreon page, which I was really excited about. Yep. And um, I wanted to just give a shout out to everybody um, who signed on yesterday um, onto our Patreon to help out um, with the stream and and this, and um, all of our, you know, bringing you entertainment. Yep. Um, so I wanted to say thank you, um, Holly Webster. Cara Campbell, Matt Reynolds, uh, Megatron, uh, Michael Kanemoto, Mike Wilson, uh, Shane Levin, uh, Wilfred uh, Lavray, I hope I said that right, Wilfred, uh, uh, Chris Barron, and uh, Donnie Herbert. I wanted to thank, thank you. you. Um, oh, Nicholas Phillips, you're Megatron. Okay, great. You just signed it on oh, as Megatron, right on. <laughs> so I thought maybe that's what you wanted to be called by. But anyway, well, I thanks, wanted to, Nicholas um, Phillips too. I wanted to say thank you to all of you so much for your support. It's gonna uh, be huge for um, helping things along, better yep, internet yep, service, yep. paying for. Uh, we're gonna we're getting our website fired yep. up now that we're gonna start linking in with um, with the stream. Um, what I'm hoping is that we'll. Um, what I'm hoping is that we'll be able to, to eventually link it up so that we can have like a little description of each episode on the website and like links yeah, to the yeah, stuff that we Yeah, yeah, just kind of a, a hub, almost like going to your local PBS channel. Yeah. Right? It, was a, it is a lot for the first day, so I apologize. I know, it's I'm crazy. Um, I'm si I said it right with a bit of an American accent. All right. <laughs> um, and yes, I understand the... Um, the uh, Thank you, Mini Fig Chick. Yeah, thank you, Mini Fig Chick. Um, Noob Master sixty nine again. Do not worry about it. You do. There is no reason for nope. you to contribute to the stream other than just being here and hanging out. No, this and is we a got free. Your... It's a free place to yeah. hang out and come and have fun and talk about Lego and build stuff. Yeah, and and thank you. I got your email and thank you very much for your kind offer. But please do not send us your um ewok village that is yours and you should keep yeah. it and you know i think sending it here and then us sending it back to you and all that might be uh, a lot of mail so yep. why don't we i think you should hang on to your uh set but thank you so much and it's very sweet of you to offer we appreciate that hey um, dallas rich uh so yeah i'm sorry about the lag i don't know I don't know what to say. We got faster internet. It doesn't always work the way yeah, it's supposed yeah. to. Um, I I apologize for that. Um, yeah, so... we're just gonna we're gonna keep streaming and hopefully it'll catch up. You want to give a shout out to who's here today? Oh sure, let's do that. Yeah, if it gets unwatchable, let us know and we'll start a new stream. Yeah, um, we don't we hate but doing that. But yeah, if but we otherwise, have to, we hopefully, will. it just catches up. Yeah, it's funny, Little Block Studio. Um, uh, I say it's cold here when it's like 40, but then we don't have any, our house isn't insulated. We don't have cold weather clothes. Yeah. So um, I hope it warms up there. So Joshua Zender's here, Little Block Studios, Joshua Steele. Uh, Jordan Zender, Supreme Lego Empire Moto is here. Wilfred's here. Chris Barron. Uh, let's see. Nicholas Phillips. Did I say that one already? New Master 69 is here. Mini Fig Chick. Sarah Kino <laughs> is here. This is so great. Um, I know Sadie, Sadie is, is here. here. Uh, B Duel 98. How's it going? Uh, so I'm just trying to get Zach Martinez. I'm yeah, I hope we cool don't miss anyone. 420. Wow. Uh, oh my god, there's so Squ many people. Jason Squirrel Girl Secrets, 42. Squirrel Girl 42. Mr. John is here. Um, B Duel 98. My goodness. Mason Bentley. Michelle Hainlein. Wow, wow, this is crazy. I know, there's so many people hanging out with us. We should build some stuff. If we missed any of your names, Doc Sampson, if we missed any of you, well, hello, welcome yes. to our hangout. Yeah. 
Um, okay, so the sound is okay. So today's stream is like the radio with some stop motion images. Oh, wow. That's a bummer. Oh, I wonder that if we should really... restart. Do we have anything else going? Like, can you close down that other browser? Uh, let's see what we got going on here that may possibly be interfering. I don't see anything. Well, we got the audio up. <laughs> I know, we got the audio. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think we have any other apps going right now. So let's, um, we're going to try again. Bye, Noobmaster69. Thanks for stopping in. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I did, Joshua. Oh, brought I got to you email. by Ray Harryhausen. We love Ray Harryhausen. It is. Oh, Dallas Rich says it's not laggy for him. Um, okay. Well, we're just going to, um, we're just going to keep at it. Yeah, actually, could we just get, like, a, a, I would like to hear from people uh, that are getting laggy as opposed to not laggy, because I'm seeing it be laggy here on my end. Um, so I can only imagine it is for for most people on on the other end. I'm not sure. Um, well, we have some new hardware coming that's hopefully going to help with that stuff, too. We're just constantly trying to make it better. Mm, very laggy. Mm, I'm getting laggy, laggy, well, I'm hearing. Should we, okay. should we start it over? So, real quick, I am going to... Okay, sorry, everyone. All right, so what I'm going to do is, I don't know if this will fix anything, but I'm going to stop the stream and then, like, restart it. So we'll see what happens. Just okay, hold on. So, so catch um, us in the... Yeah, will it be a new stream? Hopefully it'll stream right back here. If it does not, though, please um, hop over to the other stream. All okay, right. Okay. Sorry about that. Um, we'll catch up to you. All right. I'm going to. I'm going to stop streaming, and we'll see you in just a second. Okay. Good luck. Thanks, everyone. Hi, everybody. Hi. We're back. Hopefully, um, this is better. We'll see. Yeah. Is this a little bit? Is this a little bit better now? I hope. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, good. Way better. I like that. I like oh, hearing good. that. Oh, good. Hooray. Yeah. Well, right. welcome back. Hey, and it kept it into the same stream, so I feel Oh, that's great. So that. everyone's still here. Great. Yeah. So we'll learn about that in the future. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, again, sound is good. It's just a video. Um, oh. I'm hearing better. I'm hearing worse. Still a bit. Yeah, well. Joshua Steele says better. I did notice that our... Um, our um, that our internet was running kind of slow today anyway yeah um yeah so anyway let's uh let us move on with our day so we're going to start off with yep. our as usual our the disney, disney pin of the pins. day i've got a huge one today so i was going uh, i was going through and um writing article for brothers brick this morning and i came across this amazing aladdin mock which i'm sure will be up in the next few days on brothers brick but um uh, I wanted to, so today I'm wearing my, um, Aladdin and Jasmine pin that actually Sam Hatmaker gave me, Sam from the show. Oh, that's awesome. He has a great I saw pin him. collection. Yeah, he does. All different kinds of pins. Yeah. Um, and I'm doing the glow in the dark haunted mansion. Oh, big giant pin. Jelly. Bigger, the bigger pin mansion. than I usually wear, but I love that one. It's so gothic. Not enough hamster chow. <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess think that's it right. We didn't wind up the springs enough. Well, we appreciate you sticking with us, and I'm, I, I have to apologize oh, for the quality we, of the stream. I'm so sorry. Um, we will move to <laughs> Stop. <laughs> wow, okay. I know, so, Haunted Mansion, right, Wilfried? Well, we can be radio. We both have had radio shows in the past. We have, it's so true. So if today turns into radio, then, well, we'll describe the pieces to you. Yeah. Hey, Gallagade, <laughs> how's it going? Uh, Joshua, I can, um, I can try and email you back, and I just wanted to let you know that I have gotten um, people's entries for the building contest. Oh, cool. Uh, which Already we should coming talk about. in. Remember, it's due tomorrow at the end of the stream. So it's a, um, a 16 by 16 build of your choice of a building. So any kind of building you want to make, any scale, it just has to fit on a 16 by 16. Send a picture in to Flynn at TrickyBricks.com, and we will be um, posting it uh, tomorrow. Yeah, you or, know what? Uh, Friday, sorry. I know we'll what be showing I'm, it on Friday. I know what I'm <laughs> going to make, but I haven't made it yet. I'm going to build mine tonight. Oh, you're going to build yours tonight, huh? Yeah. Yep. Okay. I am. 
We'll see how that goes. I, I know what I'm going to build, but um, a lot of the the bricks are going to tell me a lot of um, it. Lil Box Studios, it is not actually a contest. It is, it is just no. a challenge. Yeah. Um, it's like a show and tell. Like, a yeah. make, make something cool and show it, and everyone gets to see everyone yeah. else's stuff. Yeah, and then stuff. you send it to us, and we put it in a little slideshow and show it on the stream. Yeah. <coughs> I find if I have a challenge, I hmm. build a lot more, because otherwise I just noodle around and push things around or sort. Well, don't forget, you have until tomorrow uh, yep. at the end of the stream to to get that on. So. Yep. Okay, and we're going to continue doing stuff like that. I think building with you all is great. Right, So just and if you want details on that, they are in the description of the video uh, below if you scroll yep. down. So what are we building today? Um, let's see. We are working on... That's right. We're working on... <laughs> we're actually going to build. The pop-up party goes, You know, again, it's like 10, 15. This it's is our usual. Bad. No, um, it's just my thing. I have to always say that. Yeah. Isn't it? Don't you like that about me? He likes that about me. <laughs> I love it. Um, so we're building the pop-up party bus, and yes. gosh, it is colorful. Well, that's the white side. That's the back side, right? It's got this great, like, disco lighting effect. It's so good. I'm really excited for this one. And it's right? got a lot and of she bags. she turns back and forth. So uh, let's see. You got some fun technic letting me know there's other mechanical things that are going to come into play. <laughs> So is anyone else out there building mocks? Well, I guess people are build, oh. building for the challenge. Are you building other things too? Do you regularly? I know I know Moto's always building something crazy. Yes. I'm still blown away. This um, That piece of his keeps getting bigger and bigger by orders of magnitude. Wait, I gotta, sorry. I What's going a, on? Oh, I'm just, you know, I try to keep up. Um, sometimes people send emails oh, in the middle. Uh, there, see, because we organized all of our bags okay. inside our box, I can just go here, and number five is right on top. Yep. Did we do four yesterday? We did. We did four. So, um, this is, so now we're going back to sort of a, let's see, looking at the tiny keyboard. <laughs> I know, at the tiny keyboard. We never use that split side-to-side -side screen, Stop do we? Stop thinking what I'm thinking. <laughs> we do this thing now. We've got, we've been here so long too together much, and married much. for so long that yeah. we are just, um, uh, we think the same stuff a lot. And yeah, it yeah. happens well, the way all I, the time. I figured <laughs> out that we're using similar um, algorithms, he and I, <laughs> and now that we're staying at home so much, we're getting similar sensory <laughs> input, so the output is... <laughs> we keep coming up with the same stuff. Is that happening to you? Oh, time twisters oh, mock steampunk really punk with a big Rocky Horror twist. I love it. Glitchy today. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. We're just gonna, we're gonna try and push through it. I think it may not be on our end because our hardware hasn't changed. It may be well, uh, either it's super I, fast internet we're supposed to have. Yeah, the alleged <laughs> internet. It's supposed to be super fast. <laughs> All the clocks say it's fast. Yeah, well, that's clocks for you. Yep. What am I saying? I have no idea. I just say stuff. I don't know. That really didn't come from... <laughs> Do you need to you need a reboot? Yeah, oh man, do I? I need a reboot to like a month I ago. I have. I know I mentioned this before, but I used to tour. Um, I used to uh, tour internationally doing multimedia lighting design and other stuff, um, video, and we used cutting edge, state of the art software, which meant that it was prone to crashing and it would crash in front of an entire audience, and we would have to reboot the computer and then. You would hear the reboot chime. It was, right. gosh, computers. Oh, wow. But all in all, we're building an exciting pop-up party bus. Yes, yes. Today. Um, hey, and we're going to get some more mini hey, 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 but, too. Uh, hey, Marilyn, how's it going? Uh, let's see. Okay, so let's go ahead. Should we try to get started? Shall I make something yeah, happen I'm here? Yeah, I'm sorting some stuff here. Yeah, we're getting, we're getting our things sorted out. We got out. the chat part down. Yes, we do. Got back um, into stop motion for oh really Supreme Lego Empire. It takes so much patience to do stop motion, or you could just do a video stream with a glitchy internet connection. <laughs> yeah, we did a little bit of stop motion and it took forever, but it was fun. 
Yeah. I liked it. Okay, so let's move on. We need um, four one by one white squares. One by one white squares in yes. the bowl. It's in the bowl. <laughs> See that quote in Caddyshack there, your favorite movie? No, I don't know because I don't know the movie. So if you okay. tell me, I know. Hey, what's your coffee cup today? Oh, yeah, and actually, I can actually hold it up a little better. So this is, now, I, I'm going to start off by saying that, like, I'm not really a um, a Starbucks person at all. But, but you're a coffee person. And I'm a coffee person, and we went to Disney World for our five-year anniversary, and I got this awesome um, Magic Kingdom mug that I love, and we got Richard an Epcot one. It was, um, it's really just, I thought it was a really fun illustration. But it does, in fact, say Starbucks really big on the side of it. So I'm just going to yeah. hold it in this direction. <laughs> and mine, why am I holding it not by the handle? Oh, because down camera. Uh, mine here is NASA, because NASA rules. Yeah. They're heroes of mine. <laughs> All right, and the pop-up party bus, which okay. in the in, on the box, it looks like it's flying. Does it fly? I don't remember. Does it yeah, fly I in the movie? It's, yes, it's a, it's a spaceship bus thing isn't it which would explain why it has such <laughs> impractical wheels <laughs> they're just like landing gear um synthetic mason yes um we are we do actually have some merchandise coming um we are we're working on it we have stickers that are on the way um, yeah they're they're coming within a day or so yeah and we're going to have um we've got t-shirts uh, that we're working on um, we have designs and we have this you know that amazing artwork by kevin hinkle um that's going to adorn all of our uh, all of our different things so yeah excellent i will and yeah, we'll definitely and let you know we're seeing we're probably gonna at least just because we want coffee cups and we want to give them to our parents we're gonna make coffee cups too right well you know and it's funny too because um this is all taken. This is all <laughs> taken off so quickly. It is. It's it's taken us fast. a little bit of back, and suddenly, like I'm navigating. Well, we're not appalled. No, no, but it took me back as as like as far as like whoa, I had no responded. idea. And you know, now it's like managing. It seems like there's like a new thing to manage every day. You know, it's like I've got Instagram down. Then we moved to YouTube, and we're hopefully starting to get that down. Yeah. And then, um, and then it was Patreon. And then it was adding in, uh, you know, trying to make our Facebook page and now a website. And oh my goodness, it's just so much. So definitely, like, um, a Red Bubble store is on the way, and coffee cups will absolutely be um, a thing. And so I think very think appropriate. We like coffee. Sig figs would be pretty cool. I'll have to, um, I'll have to see if I can gather some. You know, like, how I, expensive it would be to make some parts because I be thought fun. about sig figs, and we know someone who does amazing printing too. Yeah, well, actually, we thought about getting Tricky Bricks. The Tricky Bricks logo on on torso, like on a minifig torso. Yeah. I don't know if anybody would be interested in that, but I think that would be really fun. And, of course, we're going to have um, one ba by eight <laughs> bricks donated by our wonderful friend Steve Parmley and our friend Dan Keyes, both friends of ours and friends of the feed. So, um, yeah. Well, if we, make, if we make torsos, then we could make little adventures for us to have, like, little mock adventures. We could absolutely have adventures. We have a lot of um, torsos from the different um, oh, and look, things we've been here's to. that same... Oh, can we go into the close-up camera now that we're going to start assembling? Oh, sure. Assembly square. There's one that I missed. Yeah. Um, wait, where are we going? Is there that right go. there? Am I in the shot? You're in the shot. I am. Oh, sort a little of, further. A little further in. Look. Oh, and laggy. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I know. I keep moving. There we in. go. There we go. So that piece there is two by two on the bottom, and it's got this 90 degree... Um, one by two sticking out of it, same as we <laughs> used for the speakers. <laughs> um, yeah, co coffee cups, t-shirts, and Logan coffee time. <laughs> Logan cookie, <laughs> Logan, Logan coffee time. Oh my Actually, goodness! Can you imagine Logan on coffee? He's always on coffee. He's yeah. an inspiration. Logan cookie time. All right, time. let's do. Let's get. Let's get onto this. I, would I, drink just, I realize to it's that. Just a blank screen. Yeah. All right, so a two by two. Oh well, look! Gray. It's our great. It's, it's our high tech background of. Gray paper and two by two uh, black square, like black plate, right? Show all right. We got several of, of these double jump plates. Oh, too. exciting! Look what we're getting ready to do. So, two Technic one by one bricks with a hole in them. This is so exciting. Technic, <laughs> okay, in tan or in gray, right? 
Yep, and then two of those hinges that we like. Okay, here's something embarrassing. So I know you know, like, we have our own Lego language and stuff. And so this particular hinge is a favorite part of ours. Yeah, and, just the plate But we hinge. still don't have a proper name for it. I guess we could call it like plate hinge, but we never do. I was like, I need one of those hinges. I'm you, like, know, you know, those the ones one by that two goes, things that go like this. Or we call them the eater, eater. <laughs> <laughs> this eater, eater hinges. Right, it works. We know what we're talking about. <laughs> but I'm so glad I've never had to like try and do. Yeah. Yeah, we have to pretend it's stop motion. I'm so sorry. I feel just terrible. Uh, about that, but you know, it is what it is. So, um, all right, two, we have one by two. Uh, yeah, a little, now a little Ray Harryhausen. Now there. it's definitely a Harryhausen movie. Okay, is this, can we see what's going on here? Yeah, we're adding these hinges on here. All right, and now these coral plates. Don't talk to me before I've had my Logan cookie time. <laughs> Matt Reynolds, you are so right. Oh my god, he gets... That dog, he gets so much attention. And then we get up in the morning after hanging out, you know, having our coffee. And he wants more attention. <laughs> it's true. So what are we building on I have the no idea bus? what we're building. This is a sub build, and I didn't... Oh, we're making Look. this crazy... I think it's like the side. Oh, we're making like super speakers for it. Super right. speakers. Oh, I think it's the side of... Like this side over here. Yeah, that's why we're... We're going to use these dishes. Yep. And how okay. about that? And that's why we have these pieces. Do we have two one by 4 uh, white plates? Yes. Go here and here. And then we need... Well, oh, look at that. I'm assembling something. Four, four <laughs> one by 2 white plates. Four one by 2 white plates. Got it. Two one by two magenta plates and two one by two coral plates. Coral? coral. <laughs> Stud City says, uh, I, he can imagine me yelling to you across the Lego Masters floor into the brick pit. Get me the eater, eater parts. <laughs> <laughs> Similar probably happened. <laughs> Similar. So what are Bye, we doing? Bye, Ingrid. Here? Thanks we're for getting, stopping in. Oh, we're getting one by ones, are we? Um, no. No, we need all of these. Yeah, I got the. I got two of those, and then two coral. Yes. And it looks like what we're gonna do is we're gonna alternate them. So it's and you can do that that side if you want. Okay, here's here. A coral. Let's get to this. Cool. What am there's, I doing? I can't coral. see what you're doing. The pattern is coral and then white. You're putting these on the underside. Okay. Right. Look and at they, that. We'll have an example of why we don't ever keep our hands on the same model at the same time. <laughs> and then what? And Dark then, pink and or then magenta? magenta? And then white. There. Can you say right. awkward? <laughs> <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do, yeah. right? We got it. We're gonna get her done. <laughs> He doesn't like I'm it. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. He doesn't like it if I say get her done. That was no. no he doesn't like. Don't that. ever do that again, and don't ever do that here in front of company. <laughs> <laughs> if I, if we were if if I was a kid and yeah and and uh, you know my mom was in the room and I was like like that, she would have said stop showing your behind. <laughs> <laughs> So do these go on the colors that match them? Yes, yes. And then there's and we have white ones as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it drives me crazy. Hello, Blair. How's it going? Oh, hi, Blair. Apparently, we're having a stop action animation day today. So, um, welcome and enjoy the show. Mm. We could do stop Frog motion break effects. Is absolutely perfect. Um, all right. Yep. Uh, Wilbert says, the color pattern is the same as yesterday. Uh, white, coral, white, magenta. Yeah, it's got those same little... Yeah, you know, maybe little it'll line up. up. Yeah, see, here we go. You're right. That yep. Will probably, it will probably ma match up right in there. Is it? All right. That works. 
All right. <laughs> Sarah Keen, I'm so glad. <laughs> oh, Mini Fig Chick is working on a poster <laughs> of Tricky Freaks. Please. Yeah, it's the glitchiness. It's it's just the internet today is being Yeah, a it's jerk. we tried a new stream. We're just gonna go with it. It's kind of like an enhanced radio program today. Yeah, so imagine like radio program with snapshots. Imagine you are in a uh, movie theater at the you know early, early silent films but with sound. <laughs> That makes no sense. All right, even so we're going to get some cheese right. wedges here, too, right? <laughs> I'm just gone moving over, right past I think I've gone all over of the that madness. Two one-by-two plates, or actually four one-by-two plates. Of what like color? White. And then one, and then two magenta ones. These balls are working out really well. Okay, so where do these go? Um, On, on top of the ones that match. Oh. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, we're making quite a lot of stacks of these um, these little. Yeah, well, they want those here. individual stripes, mm -hmm. right? And then the magenta ones. It's almost like a mosaic, you know, like a plate mosaic. All right, and then it's a uh, hin, and then we're gonna do hinges again. Okay, that's the inner e ones. The inner yes, e e e hinges. They're great. <laughs> well, that's another of those. Small pixels things that I think about a lot is plate mosaics. Like um, here, that's a pretty small pixel. Wait, let me turn it over. There you go. Right? Smaller than a stud. All right. Oh, look. Well, I just when, made this pop off. When we, it's so funny. Whenever we are trying to work on um, like the same thing at the same time, I always think, because we're so awkward about it, but I always think about... I don't know if you've seen it, that movie called City of Lost Children, and there's, like, the two twin sisters that they, yeah. they cook an entire meal. It's an amazing scene. It is so right, good. Right, each with using the other hand. Yeah, and there it's <laughs> just, and I was like, I want to be like them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're not. No, we're not, and they, are, <laughs> they were actually terrifying. So, um, all right, uh, we're going to now do cheese wedges. This way. Of the same the, color. All the same color on the same things with all the There's things. a motif here. Oh, here, let's go up out of the border. Oh, yeah, sorry about that. Okay, what's going on? All right, and then we need single white wedges. And then that'll be There's the other side. There's one single white wedge. Mm -hmm. Two, three, four. Meh, meh, meh. <laughs> yes, you need piano music. <laughs> Oh yeah, Blair, that movie is great. It is a favorite. I got to what, see it in City the movie theater. Children? Yeah, and it was fantastic. Okay, now these go up here. Yep. Okay, now we're gonna get the other kind of hinges that okay, we she's call kind of getting in the way. that we call rocker hinges. Rocker, yeah. They're the rockin' in the USA. So they're gonna we're gonna Yeah, I don't know what these are this? actually called. I call them rocker hinges because it's, they rock. It back seems and to forth. make the most sense. Let's grab these, and there's gonna be there's three on each side, so. It okay, looks and like... do they just split it evenly? No, there's actually an empty space right here. And are they mirrored? Yep. They are in fact. Oh, I just started using mirrored. the mirror tool in my drawings a lot, and oh my goodness, it saves oh, me so much okay, work. Okay, here we go. This will be interesting. Where's the other rocker hinge? Right here, but you need to take the. the oh, the, I. The rocker off of it. <laughs> Makes me think of heavy metal parking lot. Uh, hey, Micah. Yes, we know that it is. Um, it's laggy. It's just yeah. the way it is today. Sorry about that. Sorry. Um, uh, I will. You know, I'll call. No, I'm not. I'm, I was just gonna say I'll call Comcast. I'm not send calling a, Comcast. Send a sternly worded email. Yeah, because you know what? They don't care. <laughs> <laughs> We're hoping we're gonna, you know, we're just gonna do some timing checks and all that and see what we can do. But for now, it's enhanced radio. Well, we also do have some, you know, we may we we have some major improvements coming, which I'm pretty excited about. Yeah. Um, things planned. Things planned. All right. So the these guys. Okay. There's a little. One of those? Yeah. Uh oh. Somebody's seeing squirrels. Yeah, I know, cause we let him be with the squirrels oh, we let him be with the squirrels that's what happened. he saw what two happens. on his walk today and i thought he was going to lose his mind <laughs> 
Okay. Okay, and is there one another of one of these? Yeah. They're starting to round things off. <laughs> hey, Johnny, how's it going? We are oh, in Zonker is a here. stop action animation today, apparently. Right. <laughs> we're, what we're, we're, uh, what are they called? Craft work. We're craft work today. Oh, Mil, uh, what is Michelle Hainline says, does anyone else have to uh, have the Lego logo all going in the same direction when you're building? It's my OCD. Yes. Our friend, we don't, or we at least don't. I say I don't. Well, we, we don't, but our friend does. Our friend Drew. Yeah, our friend Drew does. Yeah, um, he likes them to all go the same Drew's way. Drew's a big, uh, big uh, friend to the stream and and friend of ours, and has donated a bunch of really amazing sets. To yeah, us. we've we've put some of them together um, on the stream already, and we'll be putting more together. And actually, I should say, our friend David Robinson came by yesterday. Dave, I don't know if you're on the stream, but thank you so much. He came and brought us not only some awesome homemade food, yeah, but we had the, a... um, the Creator Three in One Corner Deli set. For us to put on, uh, put together. Yeah, we had a um, little social... Oh, he is here! David's here. No, did you did not miss Cookie Time with Logan. No, no, not at all. No, we've got plenty of time before that. But we do have sticker time. Oh, do we have sticker time? But I have time? to do my research. So I'm going to do... Okay, a, you do your research. research. <laughs> I thought I was so prepared today. Oh, so I wanted to show you that um, we left that space open... And now we're using that same part that we used. Now, this time it's in gray, and I think you can see it a little bit better. But it's like a, a two-by-two two plate with a one-by-two plate kind of, like, sticking off of it. It's so great. And we used it on the inside here in black. And it's what we did the, um, the what we made the speakers with. Okay. Very good. Um, yes, Richard is currently researching his stickers. And then we will be back with that in a moment. Oh, you see what he's on about? No, I'm seeing what he's on about. Okay, it's a, yeah, what is it? Let's find out. What is Logan freaking out about, honey? He sees a squirrel, but I don't see it. Oh, okay, so he sees a squirrel, but you don't. <laughs> yes, yes. Lego LA Maniac, yes, that's the party bus. We are partying on the party bus today. Slowly partying. Um, all right, and we are using these curves here to make this shape. And we're going to add more of these Technic pieces. There we go. And hey, Gallagate, if I didn't say hello, hello to you. Um, there we go. All right. Oh, moving swiftly along. All right, so now we're going to put the the hinge, you know, like the rocking part into the rocker hinge. And they're going to go with the with the long side sticking out. It's funny I'm right? saying no. What are you, what, you're not finding anything? No. Isn't there a number on it? There is, and it doesn't come up in, in two different um, searches. Did you put just the number, or did you also say sticker set? Oh, I may have it. Lego Architect is the two one. No, that's a, I'm pretty sure that's a Ninjago one. <laughs> All right, so I've put all of my um, my rocker hinges on, and now they're having me fold them all down this way. Or, yes, it's having me fold them all down. And then we're going to put a coral... <laughs> Won't you all be glad when we're done putting this together so that we don't say that anymore? <laughs> and then... And we will never receive a Lego set with coral pieces again. Because <laughs> nobody wanted to do it. We could ban that word from the, um, in the algorithm. Oh, Shane. Um, Shane, yes, I did see all the Animal Crossing updates. Actually, um, Kim uh, Zarakino, she um, uh, turned me on to all the updates. Because we were talking the other day and I was telling her, oh, 
You know, I feel like I'm just in maintenance mode in my town all the time now. Oh, although I have a big announcement. To everybody who's following from the beginning, I know that you will be, be glad to hear that Jambet told me that she's moving out last night. And I have never been so excited. <laughs> yeah, I was... Um, as you know, I've been done with Jambet for quite some time. And I was just waiting for her to leave. So... Yeah, but I'm very excited about the art, the um, art museum expansion, and um, the the uh, and that Leaf's gonna be there selling all of his little like shrubs and stuff. I'm excited for that. I think Leaf is gonna be, be selling his shrubs. So he's the garden he's salesperson. The garden. Named Leaf. Yes, and he is, um, and it's escaping me right now. Somebody please tell me, remind me what Leaf is, because I can't just. Um, it is more exciting than Scoot leaving because I like with Scoot I used the amiibo to to kick him out, but with Jambet I just had to play the long game and just not talk to her for a really long time. Oh my goodness, how nice is this? Look what time it is, Flynn. It's like oh, a wait. sticker time. Oh, is it? Is it the? T is it yes. that time? Okay, uh, let's We have a special see. Lego sticker episode because I have no idea what this sticker is. Okay, here we go. I'm sure that looked, you know, That's like kooky, some really right? terrible, uh, uh, like, uh, uh, 60s uh, animation uh, uh, or something uh, uh, like that. Super <laughs> slow-mo. Okay, so here's what we've got. Um, okay, I, I goes... today's episode is called Name That Sticker what Set. What is the sticker? What is, I know it's a Ninjago set, but... But I enter these numbers, these, like, numbers at the bottom, and nothing comes up on any browser that I could find. On but any I, browser? Wow, you used multiple browsers? No, I used I used two devices. Wow. Okay, right? Okay. So kind of art deco, kind of, um, <laughs> you know, Chinese inspired? Uh, Asian inspired, probably. I don't well, know. Well, the red the, and... The, yeah, the red, the and, red gold. and gold makes me think Chinese. Sure. I don't know. So let's see. So are you sure? No, I don't think it's Nexo Knights. I mean, maybe it is, but I remember it there be, being... It but it doesn't have that sci-fi quality to it. Yeah, you, I mean, I remember be right. there being a Ninjago set that used that olive green. Oh, Chima! Ooh! Oh, that makes Chima. sense. Okay. So the whole web was like Chima. I'm not going to give any responses. Wow. I love Chima. I have a bunch of them. Well, Blair, if you want the olive stickers, maybe we'll take the red and black ones and I'll send you the olive ones. Because I want to see what you'll do with them. <laughs> uh, no, Doc Sampson, you did not miss Logan Cookie Time. I love that that's the first people... Um, the first thing that people ask when they come in, did I miss Logan Cookie Time? Um, oh, Matt Reynolds says 70738 oh. Final Flight of Destiny's Bounty. Oh, and we have two of those because we won them. Um, we won that set Oops. the year that we brought California Dream in, and we won um, People's Choice and Best in Show. And this the prize for them was the same. So we got these two awesome sets. Like I have two big sheets of this plastic red. Um, yeah. Okay. I don't know. P so possibly. I just I, we, found. It's... Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Yeah, one. that's okay. I just found this Chima guy here, and I don't know. His costume looks an awful lot like some of that. Wow. Could, could okay. be Chima, right? All right. Oh, but some everybody. I've got two people now confirming um, seven zero seven three eight. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, it doesn't say that on here, but I trust Not the bottom. You but know, I, I believe um, you. What is seven zero seven three eight? Yeah, it says took ten seconds on Brick Owl. I just typed in stickers. <laughs> well, there you go, honey. You learned something new today. Well, David Robinson. <laughs> You are a better sticker searcher than I am. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Whew. All right. Here we well, go. Well, see, we learn stuff here on the building chat. So we've made this little um, curved piece now. Okay. Um, out of all these, like a couple plates. It's like a plate with um, with two smaller plates on the ends. And then all the right. center plate has two of those cool jump plates that have the two... 
uh, the two awesome. jumps side by on side. Them. And, and so that's why you can see they're fitting right in the center and coming all the way to the end. So smart. Yeah. I like that piece a lot. 70738. Okay, thank <laughs> David you, Robinson. everyone. David Robinson, your baked goods are amazing. What was that? That apple? I, well, like, I don't know what that was with the pieces of apple in it. It was so delicious. It was really amazing. Oh, and looks like we are going to make a second one of these. Oh, cool. So okay, why, don't you, look. Why, don't you re, why don't you reverse engineer that, or do you want to look at the instructions? No, I want to make it up. You want to make it up as you go along? Yeah. All right. I'm... I want to blunder in. <laughs> <laughs> we are not stopping for directions. <laughs> hey, Mark Crookshank is here, everybody. Oh, Mark, hey, Mark. From Lego Masters. One of the bearded builders. It's so good to see you, Mark. Ooh. I'm glad you're here today. Oh, Logan Ooh. is. Oh my. Whoa, like, Logan that was is almost a like, bark apparently there. like on the on the hunt. My goodness. All right. Well, maybe it's almost time for a Lego cookie. I time. think maybe it's, he's going to be extra excited though right? because we let him go to the squirrels before cookie time happened. So, <laughs> um, yeah, we're getting there. Am I building all of this out of the view of the camera? I'm so sorry. I think so. It's okay. We can just match it to that one. So we'll put these we'll put these banana blueberry next. Just stop. Yum. I don't know about all of you, but I like there's a ridiculous um of yeah, weight. <laughs> like I just I feel like we do nothing but sail from one meal to the next. Oh at this my point. goodness. Yeah. It goes um straight from the dish sink. You might as well just throw the food right in the dish sink, right? Because I just go back and forth. I know. it's yeah. Okay, look. Exactly. We have two of these identical. All right. So we are going to put them. We're going to attach them onto... Are we still stop motion animation? I Probably. guess we are. Cookie time. It's coming up. All right. I think it's next. See, right? I usually I think, think about next. quarter to 11 is Lego cookie time. Lego, I did it again. Wow. His name is not Lego. His name is Logan. Are you sure about he, that? He has a name. <laughs> do you have your that, Do you have your supplies how does that ready? Even go. Do I? I thought I brought two out here. Maybe that was for the oh morning walk. That does. It does seem a little. That seems weird. Okay, so the long part. This tile is is just. There we go. I see how it goes. It is a tough... <laughs> oh my goodness, Logan just jumped up on my chair. Oh, there you go. So Six, part of it... Seven. See, this is what was hard about it. Part of it hooks on to those, um, those jumper plates. So it goes like, um, like this. Well, those rocker hinges can often there we be go. hard to get seated. But right. then that works so well. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Okay, so everyone, no, it's not do we have yet. our do we have our little <laughs> do we have our protective gear? I don't think we do. <laughs> what do we need? We need a cloth or something. He is going out of his mind. Oh my goodness! Yeah, sorry, everybody. Well, you know what? I'm going to stop apologizing. There's nothing I can what? do what about it. What are you it. apologizing? So, oh, you know, I feel bad oh, about, about the, drop the, the stream. Well. We're doing what we can, and we'll catch up tomorrow. Okay, here we go, everyone. It's that oh, time. Bum, bum. Okay, it's, it's Logan, Logan cookie, cookie time. time. Logan, come here. Good boy. Okay, calm down. He's never well, they late must, for his They entrance. must think that he... I mean, he is full of energy, but he's usually a little more... Fo he's very focused on the cookies, though, right? Yes. Look at that. Look, you can almost see his face, right? Okay. <laughs> and here, you get the last one. Logan, cookie time! Yay! Sheer joy. <laughs> Sheer joy. <laughs> All right, thank you, Logan. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Okay, we're all back. right. Um, we're, we're back, back over to here. building with Lego. The focus, the focus of this show. I love it. Um, <laughs> Moto says the animation was super smooth because, of course, it is. Like the one thing that works. Like usually, it's that that's chunky, and of course, today. Right. Okay. Whatever. All right. So we're gonna build a couple of speakers. 
You want to build a couple of speakers? Okay, here? I'm building speakers. So I'll here we can uh, we can do this, and uh, we're gonna each need four of these and one square. And we're building upside down, and we're gonna fill in here just in these little corner yep. pieces. <laughs> Your dog is in system. All right, Muggsy watches too much. <laughs> okay, and then we're gonna do those these tiles here. Like this. Wow, I like that as a as a new as a new thing to say not related to Lego. It's in system. His mm. dog is in system. We Does need, that mean like um, he's in sync? He gets it. How about four what, you're asking one by me two tiles? Yeah. I'm busy blabbing. Just so we can. So okay, we can, so what's um, going on here? Two, There's two like this. Oh uh, wait, we don't have four. Oh, we do. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> All right, what's next? We're almost done with this bag. Wow, David. I think we're going to do two. David Parma. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I know you didn't mean to do that. I'm totally kidding. Um, okay. I know, isn't the um, spell is the worst? It's so, it's it's awful. And the spell check or whatever it is, the, what am I calling it? I don't know what I'm saying. I've lost my mind. Um, just, just call it an algorithm, then it sounds sciencey. Oh, okay. It's an algorithm. I love that story. Oh, okay. So it hooks on to here. Oh, look at that. So we right. built, we built up, um, you know, on this side of it in order to make our speakers, and we have this piece, uh, with studs up. Oh. Right. Thank you. Autocorrect. <laughs> Auto. And then we built in this piece. Um, <laughs> Oh, Marilyn, you did uh -oh. that. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Shoulda known. Um, so here it, we have the, this now that will accept those studs on the back. Well, so basically this turns out to be a reverse snot piece, right? Yes. It gives you the reverse side of a plate not on top. Which is yeah, overburdened. Know. We'll have for to make up anagram. some <laughs> absurd name for that. <laughs> What, the backwards snot? We could just call them backwards snot pieces. Okay, we are looking for two pin to studs here. Just pin to studs for all of that? Well, we're going to... So this is... So I'm going to show you what happens here. So we, you remember that we had these um, these two um, technic, uh, technic lift arms sticking off of the back of this, right? And... Now I don't know if you saw right. too much, but Sorry when we were there. when we were building this little piece, check yeah. out the um, when we were building this little piece, we left two holes in here. Oh, that are going to now slide onto those because Lego. Yeah, but we need the we need the pin to studs in there first. Um, they they yeah. So one goes here. There we go. And then another one in the, right, yep, next to it. <laughs> okay, so look at that. That really so, yeah, comes down just that half awesome. Step. So this closes like this. Um, is it? It seems weird that it's off by half a stud. It does seem weird. Because it shows it up there. Are we missing a plate down below? Oh, probably. I mean, come on, you know how this works. <laughs> or do we, are we gonna? We're gonna put something through there. It looks like. Are there supposed to be? There may well be supposed to be something on the. There may may well may be well be supposed something. to be. Wait wait wait! I think I see what it might be. Yes, there are. What happened? Oh, I get it. Yes, so there are two black corners. That oh, go... I see the corners. Where do they go? They go, one goes, it goes this way with the stick pointing this way. Hey, we didn't even have to take the whole thing apart. Look at that. <laughs> if this was a Technic set, we'd be a half hour behind from doing this. Fortunately, we're not on a schedule. Um, okay. I'm so sorry. Um, I'm seeing something happened. What happened? I need to know what oh, happened. Oh, goodness. What happened? 
So oh, sweet. ET videos. I'm so sorry to hear that. That's I'm I am I'm terribly sorry to hear that. That's oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. I'm not really sure what else to say. I'm other than I'm very sorry to hear that. Um. Here we go. Okay. There we go. Now we're back on track. Oh, no, we're no. not. How is it still not? How is it still not working? Because it fit over those. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't work. Uh, he's just in the way. Okay. Oh, <laughs> wow. The mini doll just went flying. So it seems like, it, yeah, it seems like there should be a plate under here. Um, that goes sort of over top all of this. Is yes. What I think. Okay, everyone. Maybe somebody but can. But I don't know because it's got a jump plate there. I think we may have to go back a few steps. Oh, uh, we'll have to go look again. See, this is what this is what happens when we're not paying attention. Okay, so here's that. Right. right. Yeah. Then we get a. Um, Go to this page. We've got the. Oh, that's what's missing. Oh, I see. There's actually a Technic plate with a hole. That goes there. I don't see that Technic plate with a hole. I see pins. What is a Technic plate with a hole? Oh. Oh no, that's this thing. No, this was right. This okay. This was right all along. Yep. Isn't this exciting, friends? Look at that. Well, some, <laughs> sometimes there's troubleshooting. <laughs> really real world of, of Lego. It's tr it's true. Is this Well, this is, you know, this is a hard one. This is nine and up. We're in it together. Wow. <laughs> loves to just, loves to point that out. We're in this together. Are we? <laughs> to a degree, we are. are we missing a corner there, or did you just take that off? No, it came up with the it came okay. up with the underneath piece. All right, so well things come to a screeching halt. I know. I'm sorry, everybody. This is sometimes this happens, right? Okay, so look here. We've got those green bricks. We're at this level. Yep. What's this? That's that little. That's a little plate that we put on earlier. Yeah, here it goes, fun. This is as fun. <laughs> <laughs> See, sometimes Lego requires patience. Okay, yes. so are we still on so with you know, that? Yeah. Yep. No, look. There's what? there's a one by one right yep. there. It's right there. It's Is it? Yep. Okay. Because it's even okay. with this piece. And then So we're still good. So we're still good. Isn't this exciting, everybody? <laughs> Okay, and then all we do is we add this and the other one over here. I think maybe the problem is this other one. Like this piece? Yeah. Like maybe it's missing a level or some sort of some. Well, such? you don't have to take it off. Let's just put something under it. Wow. What, what just we... some random thing? Let's just <laughs> modify. Look, we could modify this set. We just put plates where we think there need to be a plate there. We, we will put plate. You heard it here first. We will put plates <laughs> where we think there needs to be a plate. I don't know if that's going to work out. No, I think but, we need to pop out these um, these guys. Okay. So that's going to require a post of some site. You want to yeah, do it? I got it. Because I kind of have to do it. No, just pop them in like a Oh, like, like a this lift direction, aren't you Sometimes clever. they do that. Ah, look at See, that. It look, works. Sometimes that works. So you, you can, can just put, put like a lightsaber in the pin to stud and pull it out sometimes. Ta-da! <laughs> yeah, ET videos. This is a really this is a really really cool. This is a really really cool set and I really like it a lot. Well, I don't know that goes under there. What? Don't be putting random pieces I'm on. I'm just adding random wow, pieces. Wow, no. That seems like it would work. Illegal. But it's not. Okay, well, look, that's exposed there. Yep, so we got all that right. And did we build the bottom of this correctly? Here's the... We're going to put that corner back on. Yep. Right? Now, I feel like it's... Then, then like you were saying, it's got to be something up in here. But I don't see... Um, especially when we get to the finished piece, let's see how many plates this is. So we have 
our striped plate. Yeah. The, oh, there's something on the bottom. Look, there's a there's a plate underneath underneath no, the hinge. This. That's that. Okay. So there's that. There's the hinge. Here, let's do this there's on another camera. Plate. There's for another people. hinge. Let's let people see what we're doing. <laughs> I'm com see. I'm completely lost. Okay, so we're going here, right? Th right this number him. of plates matches, and then this piece here is correct. Matches. Yep. So did anybody see while we were going along if the if we skipped something? Because this just doesn't seem to work. So I'll show you what it is we're having trouble with. So when we get Oops. to here, let's yeah. move some pieces. When we get to this step, right, it shows the little piece. We it shows the piece that we made there. And what I'm seeing is these, that these corners are one step above the tile, correct? And they are. They are. Right? We have a step down here and a step down here. We have Just this, like which is allegedly put together correctly, according right? to... We've got a, I don't know if you can see here, we're pulling it down so you can see, a one by two brick, and then there's a one by six brick underneath that. And another plate under that, so right. that matches. So allegedly, you're supposed to be able to put it down. Show this to the... Yeah, so it shows that you should be able to put this part down onto here, right? And that when you put it on, it's supposed to line up with the top holes of these... Oops, sorry. With the top hole, with the top parts of these. Yep, but, but what some... we're finding is that the... the piece you slide on is about a half a stud um, down. A plate. It's like a full plate down, right? So it's not it's not matching up here anymore. And we've got these exposed studs in the back. And this looks like it's what it's supposed to look like from the back. Now, what I think is going on, honestly, is that these these got mounted improperly oh like we're but that would be one whole stud off not a half a stud it is it's just a it's just see a check this that... real time tricky bricks troubleshooting <laughs> we do this for days on our mocks right <laughs> that's why it's so hard to work on it uh oh we lost a little piece here one of our I'm not quite sure where that went oh there very good no yes no, it's a, the cheese wedge goes there. This is some kind of mystery piece. Oh, this is from the front. Okay. There well, we go. Well, so what we could do is modify this in a way that I think that's going to get us in trouble further on, though, don't you? Yeah. If we're off by a plate here, then nothing else is going to fit all the way around the bus. Because everything else is correct except for these. That's but, the one thing that's wrong. Yeah, but I think, I don't know if anyone else out there knows Technic, um, would you agree these can't be a half a stud down? I'm not sure how that would... Yeah, yeah and then seems... this just pops out. Right, and remember we had to reconstruct this. Like we had a right, whole Right, because we fiasco. skipped a step at one point. <laughs> but look, on the bottom there, there's no way... Yeah, there's no see... way that you can be a half stud off. You'd have to be a whole stud off, right? This is very strange. I've never. Okay, so I'm gonna put this back together. Are you gonna be able to? Uh, we're gonna try. Remember, anyone who was with us yesterday, <laughs> we learned that if the Technic pins are not all perfectly perpendicular, you know what? I'm gonna go back oh, and goodness. look like um, a Lego brick wall. It's absolutely true. I'm going to go back and look at this piece um, when it was put in. So what we should have is this piece that looks like this. I can see it here in the instructions. It's got three open holes like this and another open hole here with a pin in it. Right? Oh, I almost got... Then, we've got a black 
one put on there eventually <laughs> like there's a of course a ton of other steps before you put the black pieces on um, but you can see here what this looks like and this should just sit right down yeah let's come back on camera yeah and this fits right down in here like this and it can't be a half a stud off because right? we've only got whole studs there right now do you think we're we got the wrong size no we can't have the wrong size lift arm because it came out of a set that's right we didn't just pull it out of our our um collection maybe we should have i don't know okay so now here we go so here's this we've got the black piece we've got the the pin to stud down here we're going to attach it onto here Mini fig chick. <laughs> how <laughs> it is a how many Lego Masters does it take? This is a set for nine years old and up. It's true. That's so embarrassing. This is how you get on TV, kids. Just like don't know what you're doing and then pretend that you do. <laughs> all right, 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 and then that all seems like it lines up really perfectly well. Right. Have you ever, you must have had this experience putting sets together, right? <laughs> like, we're not the only David ones. David Parmley. We're not the only <laughs> ones, right, that, like, screw this up so bad. So we've been on step 97 but for the about a half but hour But see, the now. difference is, though, that, like, we're doing it in front of all of you. Like, when you do it at home, <laughs> you can just pretend like it didn't happen. Right. But, like, now everyone knows. So... What I'm counting here is one, two, three, four, five, six holes. One, one two, two, three, three four, four, five, five six. six holes. That All seems right. right. And then I'm going to add in my um, those corner plates. Right. That all seems to match up perfectly. Oh, you had to tear it all apart and start it again many times. Did you put the thruster in the half pin? Did we put the thruster in the half pin? What is a half? Oh, a half pin is like a pin to stud that... Is longer pin? Yeah, this is so weird. I don't remember seeing a half pin in the model. I don't either. Where was there a half <coughs> pin? Hmm. Um, okay, so then we put the we put these on again, and we should see just a little bit of the sixth hole cut off. So that's correct. That works. And then this should just slide on and be right. And it's not. <laughs> well, are we supposed to not put it down on the? Oh. Oh, maybe it's maybe this piece is too short. Is this this dimension oh, is here? The middle piece supposed maybe to have... above the hinge. Is it supposed oh, to be another plate above the hinge? Let's find out. Let's find that out. That could be all it is is one plate like underneath these two. Let's find out. So we're gonna look now. We're gonna examine this a little bit closer. Um. Now, I was definitely, this is when you were in the other room, and Half I was maybe, <laughs> and maybe I was not, no, he would never, no. It's like a 10 minute break or anything. I found it! It's under there, There right? is a one by four gray plate that goes under here. We just took the whole thing apart, and literally, like, it was right, right there at the top. Here. So we don't have a one by four gray plate. Is it this? Yes. With, it's with the, these hinge things? It is. Let's see. It was. Yes, it is. It is it's right this there. Piece of and the does it click face bits. out or in? It faces out. Oh my goodness! Did you see that serious troubleshooting there? Serious. We found it, Nick Sweetman. We found the we've, missing we've plate. We found the missing link. There we go. Oh and my look, goodness! And I was I was ready to mod the set too. <laughs> you were ready to mod the set. You were ready to just like completely make do your own thing. Ready to it. do it wrong. Okay, where? All right. So the blue the now good. we get the blue pins again, here and here. Okay. And now we're gonna. Wow, do, that was a close one. Yeah. We, now we're gonna add these. Now these are actually really really helpful. Okay. Oh, I love these pieces. They're my new favorite piece. For making things modular and you adding can, pieces later. You can just like slide in this pin, goes all the way through, 
and it has a finisher that will accept an axle in it. Yeah, like a okay. full a full bushing on the end of it. Nick Sweetman, these will be in the bloopers. Nick, the entire show is <laughs> a blooper. All it's all a blooper. Every one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we got that set up now. And now we're going to do two more. Um, how is this? Oh, okay. So we're going to use on the, there? We're going to use these. Okay, some pin connectors. Um, two pin to studs. And Are we two doing two of these? Yes. I love the little bling. They always yeah, show a you a bling. A bling so on you know the, that it's supposed to be metal. On the metallic metallicized. There we go. Um, so one, okay. the pin to stud goes in one end, and then. Oh, like you might imagine. This goes in the other end, like that. Here and here. Oh, wait. Oh, I see it goes yep. a single way. Exactly. And now these are going to go right on here. Attached with the pin. Whoa. The okay. Squeeze, don't press. That's a thing. You know, it's funny. It's easy. Um, I say it all the time. But with Lego, so often, squeeze, don't press. And there we go. It won't fly apart. Just press your pieces together. We do need to call that than... part Susan because it is the missing one. <laughs> Uh, Christopher, I did get your email about pop badges. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um, and I, you know, I apologize, everyone. I do, I, um, we get so many emails and messages on Instagram, and sometimes I gotta say, with all the other, uh, the, all, with oh, all the other back. stuff in the, um, like that it is for the streaming and all the other new things you've been doing, it takes up a lot of time. And I don't. We try to respond to everyone. Uh, and I, we I, really do. I really do. I know it doesn't seem like it, but it's you know I'm still catching up on um, I'm still catching up on messages from Instagram from like three weeks ago. So um, I apologize. Um, all right. So where are we at? Here? Our email is down in the description of the video, but our email is Flynn at Patreon. Oh, that's a Patreon. Sorry. Uh, oh, that's right. I had a problem with like my email yep. yesterday. Uh, and starting on bag number six. Oh, that's right. It wasn't working. All right. So sorry, everyone. Yeah, our We're email is you. Flynn at trickybricks.com. I thought I fixed that, but apparently <laughs> I did not. So we're just gonna go on back to um, go on back to the regular screen. I'm so sorry, everybody. That was silly. So All right, here we go. You know, I think. I think Make, making public access television is never having to say you're sorry. Okay, maybe sometimes, but not <laughs> not for missing an email address. You know what I'm checking out here? No pieces left in the bag like yesterday. And you know it's six because it has the dot. Is that how that? that that's is, that's what, how, how it how works. That's how that the dot's for. I know you didn't know that. So I thought so, that I would oh, fill you in. So that would work with a nine as well. All right, so now we are getting ready to put together arguably um, the best part of this whole set. Let's get, um, let's do this. Look who we're at here. Oh, I recognize pieces of our famous yes, hero. Yes, we've got um, Disco Unikitty, which she's got glamorous glasses on. Unikitty designed by who? By Matthew Ashton, who is an amazing person, and he's the judge on the UK Lego Masters. Um, oh, you don't have PBS in the UK. Oh, yes, it's very, it's, it's a thing here. Um, even though they keep trying to get rid of it. Well, in the UK, don't you have... A don't you have mandated public content on the BBC channels anyway? So do you get like? Wow. I don't know. You're I, I mean, no, I, I don't know. know I don't know stuff. anything. I'm a, I'm a, I'm ignorant about that. <laughs> but it seems to me like there is content for the public good on BBC. Okay, so I'm missing one of the a one by one. There it is, not missing. Oh, and then look at this. We These have macaroni pieces. Oh, I love those. So do we have another foot? A foot? And look, and it's great. It's printed with this star and That's blue great. design. And oh, then, you can't. It's hard to see here. Yeah. But the, maybe there'll be a little bling. So, okay. Yeah, see, there's a star on it. So, Unikitty, she's here for the party. Let's get her together. I love her platform shoes or boots or whatever they're supposed to be. are pretty hilarious. Um... Then her tail, which is like a rainbow, by the way. It's like a pink rainbow tail, which is amazing. I think, haven't we seen that used as hair before? 
Uh, oh yeah, like a ponytail. Yeah, it actually works for a, a mini fig ponytail. Like if it's the only thing they have. <laughs> um, so it's a good look. It's the only hair they can. Well, it's very a uh, Mad Max, which is I guess appropriate for the times we're in right now. Okay, so now we just need Unikitty's horn, and you know it's the... less Mad Max and more Mama's family. <laughs> <laughs> Where did that come from? Well, I just, I mean, people are talking about, you know, the world's been crazy and all that, and that it would be like Mad Max with people running around with, like, mohawks and, like, spikes on their cars and all that, and it's more like, more like Vicki Lawrence in her slippers. Yeah, and where did they get of. all that Lego? I mean, oh my god, what am I saying? Where Whoa. did they get all that leather, is what I meant to say. Like, It's like the end times and everybody has a leather outfit. Well, it's they very had, punk rock. They had costume designers <laughs> in the Mad Max times. Um, What's oh, going on? Okay, if you Blair phased out there. Back. Okay, bye Blair. <laughs> All right, so... Yes, I've seen an amazing... I think I've seen on the web an image of you, like, um, like whacking the weeds with a machete or oh, something. Oh, that's one of my favorite... Looking, it's one of my favorite looking photos. Looking like you were out of the future. I really wanted to show it on here, but I refrained. But it was a pretty it's great... It's awesome. It's it's epic. Oh, what are you doing? Well, this... Uh, oh. We need to be pulling the bus over. The bus needs to pull over into the into the build area. What, what was that... What was that story you posted today about Luke and... What did I story... Now, no one on the feed will know who Luke and Laura are. No Laura. one's going to know. Okay, so does anybody know... This is the kind of thing... I posted this on Facebook today, but this is the kind of thing that happens when you have been inside and, um, like, together, not going anywhere for, like, 36 yeah. days, and you've been live streaming every day of those 36 days. Now, it helps to be approaching old like us yeah it helps me approach <laughs> so i don't know if any of you remember when um and if you're following me on facebook you'll have seen it but so there was a show called general hospital that was on in the 80s it was a soap opera and it it became it was super hugely popular like a like a pop culture icon on top okay? of normal uh, uh, soap opera audience. Yeah, on so kind of like it, it, you know, kind of like Dark Shadows was when it was on. It was like a phenomenon that like crossed tons of lines. And me being in, and when I was in high school at the time, was super um, into the show. And it was completely ridiculous. They went like just like beyond places where any other um, one would go. There was a whole thing where like Elizabeth Taylor was a guest star on it for a while. Yes, Luke and Laura. Right. Um, exactly. And. Um, and what's her uh, and yeah, so Elizabeth Taylor was that was like a big deal at the time because Elizabeth like Taylor guest starred. Yeah, she was Miko's Cassadine's um, uh, <laughs> widow, and Miko's Cassadine was a guy who was going to take over the town where General Hospital was um, with a weather machine. Like he was gonna, <laughs> yeah. The wedding was like a big deal. It was like all in all the papers and everything. So weird. Anyway. Okay, so... Long story short, too late. Fast forward to talking to about... this morning. ...about Lego mocks, right? <laughs> about people's Lego mocks and what has been done and what hasn't been done. And I said, so obviously people have done the scene of Luke and Leah, you know, swinging across the chasm on the... Um, is it on the on Death, Death Star? Because that's your favorite... That's like I your love favorite that. Thing. I want to make that in a mock, that and I haven't done time. it yet, right? And so Flynn... <laughs> and so I... And I said, I'd rather make Luke and Laura... <laughs> Jumping over Elizabeth Taylor, and it was so stupid. <laughs> and we died. And we laughed for we laughed like entirely too long about it. Like it was really dumb. And then I remembered there was a really terrible song um, that got made called General Hospital, and it was like early '80s, like but still disco, but also early rap, and like, this, like like Blondie style. Yeah, rap. and this was like, and then the the group was called the Afternoon Delights, and so of course I had to look it up. And of course, thank you, Doctor Internet. It was available um, to we'll to, to watch on YouTube. Um, right now, it says just one. So we got this one. We've got um, a an, one of these macaroni tiles in this color. Macaroni this tile in that color. I'm sorry, not tile. Turquoise. Brick. And then yeah, the turquoise and then the blue. Look at that color combination. Whoa! Woo! And one of these ones you have to plan for here. Um, 
That see, that's a case of that's. I never know what to call that. Like, is that the snot plate? We asked about that the other oh, day. Yeah, I don't know. Right? It's so I just call weird. it those ones you always have to plan for because they have that step up on them. Well, I'm sure if Joshua Gay was here, he would have the. He would know the like, exact the name. exact name. Okay, so we are actually going to use that part there, as you showed, right. and then um, I think there's a two by two white plate that goes underneath of okay. there. Okay. Then a one, we get a one by one coral. Coral. He doesn't see his voice doesn't even sound like that. But it does. It, no, but I'm going all up. He <laughs> says coral. It coral. does. I'm like that. <laughs> He's like, Dad, what? Um. Okay, so this, and then a one, a white one by two plate. Where in this hole there? Mm -hmm. And then a white one by two click hinge brick. Okay. Yep, I'm on there. And then a coral one by two. Brick? Yep, there? right next to it. Uh, long oh, piece. there. Right, and now we're going to use this famous piece that we've been using for a lot of models um, lately. This, I've seen this used so much, I'm really surprised because to me it's kind of... Um, the oh that's right that's the snout brick i'm sorry that it's is the snout, snout brick. brick that's right you're right it's true that's right right and we have frog bricks snout bricks yep wow and we're so having our own the, divergent the zigzag, evolution um the little zigzag piece here so i'm gonna call that a rigid technic offset plate but that's not what it's called a rigid technic uh, is that not yeah, that implies because, that there's a wiggly one well yeah because if that was two two by threes and a one by two it would be you know, wiggly. <laughs> <laughs> it would not be strong. Like that. All right. Okay, uh, there's a yeah, two by... we gotta by... bring Unikitty back. There's a, yeah. She needs a, uh, an appearance. A two by four plate over there. The, I mean, tile, black. And a this will four... have a sticker on it with a little, you know... The color... The, <laughs> the musical zigzag thing. A VU meter. <laughs> the VU mummy meter. thing. <laughs> oh, wow. I didn't realize oh, this came with hooray. one of these. I love this piece. Now, I have a bunch of these in clear. And this is actually purple. But this is like purple. Um, This purple transparent curved window is upside down. in love with it. This is so cool. And then we get another brick on top of that. Wow, purple and medium azure and turquoise. Okay, so that's They're one... so bold in their colors. Yeah, that's so that's one little sub build here. Wow, right? the colors look very different on video. What I'm seeing here. Yes, is... Paul. Yes, I know. It, we know it's like a, a bracket somehow, but you know we've uh, we've developed our own language, and now like if I said bracket. Yep. Richard wouldn't even know what I was talking about. Paul, if I that's say, good. Thanks for that. If I say the zigzag or the lightning bolt, then he, um, <laughs> then, he then he knows what I'm talking about. All right. So a two well, by. Well, we learn brick names by by um, by building but together. Lug bulk and and um, and. Right. Well, if buying, you don't know, buying from from uh, Bricklink. Bricklink. And you know, if you've you probably heard this story before, but I have like three full Lego languages in my brain that I uh, like at any one time. Okay, so I've we've used a snot brick, and we're using one of those little, um, those funny little snot, uh, the snout Ooh, brick on okay. top. Okay, actually, subtle thing going on here. This is a regular one by two snot brick. If you put another regular one by two snot brick on top of that, you cannot put plates across them like that because they won't be in system. Right. But if you use a snout brick like this, this, it's two this plates tall. plate, then it's in system and it fits perfectly. And look what we're gonna do on the other side of this. We're gonna use um, one of these snot downhangs, <laughs> as we call them, <laughs> snot brackets. A different kind of snot bracket. To fill in that little space, and now we've got snot pieces on both Whoa. sides. Oh, and of it's this flat cube. on top. And it's got, and yeah. And How clever that is that? Right. I know it looks like a big black blob there on the camera, but that's some fancy footwork, so I would say. There, and we have another coral. And he's gonna show up and like turn this. Table I wish, over. I wish Andrew <laughs> Lincoln would show up and do anything at our house. I wish anybody would show up and do anything at our house. I just want anyone, to right? Come. It's true. <laughs> right, it could be the Ropers. 
It doesn't matter. <gasps> Anyone, please <laughs> come save us. <laughs> All right, what are we building? Oh, oh my good. Oh, look All at right. this fancy. That is show. Will you show that instruction to them? Oh well, well I guess we'll show yeah, them, the real, show thing, them right? the real thing. Well, that's so really we're gonna cool. continue the column in this manner by using those little the snout brick with a snot downhang bracket on the other side. And we're staying in system on both sides. And we're of staying this. in system. It's true. So now we're gonna use. We have a quick hinge here. And another a coral. Coral. And then a two by two. Wait. Nope. No, we need another, another snout we need brick. A, nope. Yeah. Oh, Did it hit? Snout? yes. I will swear that it's wrong when and, it's not. And what I want to show, um, what I want to show you, um, is that because of the spacing of this, a brick and then a plate, and we've talked about this before, a brick and a plate allows us to have all of these lined up so that they are in system like there's not space in between them they are all perfectly spaced out so this is a great that, this is a great method we saw a little bit of that in the um no yeah we saw a little bit of that in the flintstones uh chimney they did a really good job of like getting um snot pieces all the way around well uh, yeah for a simple construction that is that's one of the more clever things i've seen recently all right and so we're going to finish it off with a final Oops, nope, that's the wrong one. Oh, there it is. A, a, a final downhang, as we call it. Bracket. And a downhang bracket thing. It's not deal. And a plate. We were being so technical. Right? And then, then we went <laughs> to snot deal. Failed. It's not deal. <laughs> who's Stanley and who's Helen? <laughs> Wait, what? What's that? I don't I understand. I think, isn't that Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf? Is that no. no? No, that's George and Martha. Yeah, we're George definitely Stanley, not that. No, Stanley. That's Maud. You're thinking Stanley, Stanley and, Helen. and Maud. <laughs> we went from Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf to Maud. Actually, we, we by wow. by way of Streetcar Named Desire. Just <laughs> by the way, <laughs> what the heck is happening? <laughs> couldn't it? You know, couldn't have we? Couldn't we have fit Starsky and Hutch in there somewhere? <laughs> <laughs> no. The Duke boys or like something. Yeah, no. We're going we're gonna... to... Yeah, the rope. Or... Well, there is. The... <laughs> but I am not going to start wearing moo-moos and, like, a white lady ginger afro. Like, yeah, that's not no, going to no, happen. No, no, That's not going to happen. Um... <laughs> okay, what's going on there? So we made a little decoration... Uh, with these purple and um, and uh, azure tiles, and then we should have one more. Look at that nice shape. Noobmaster sixty nine asks, "Do you know why they called it sots instead of snot?" They did. They, oh, studs on the they, side. Yeah, there was two That's different so ones. Weird. They called it snot, and then later there was a technique that we did that they called sots. And that was, I just thought that was so weird. So, which I guess heard... is studs on the side, but I've that just sounds that like before. snot to me. Yeah, I don't know. I hadn't heard that one. They did that in one of those um, uh, Microsoft Tech Note no, aside like, let's, things, right? let's never speak of the, the, the Surface. Surface Pro again. <gasps> Please, let's not mm. talk about that. <laughs> Y'all. Well, let's just say... Yes, yeah. Sadie, I love it. Maud is B. Arthur from the Golden Girls for anyone who needs yes, to know. Yes, that's exactly yes. right. Yes. <laughs> Which one of us is Starsky? I don't, you know, I don't, all I remember of Starsky, Starsky and Hutch. Starsky was the dark hair one and maybe Hutch was, well, yeah, maybe Star it was the other Starsky way around. Well, yeah, Starsky was David Soul and, and Hutch was that other guy. the other guy, right? <laughs> And I always identified more with the other guy, but mostly what I remember of that show is them running and jumping into the car through the windows. But did they even do that, or was that just the Dukes of Hazard? I think it that was. Might, the, I think it that might was have been the Dukes, the Dukes of Hazard jumping yeah, in, yeah, yeah, jumping into the unfortunately named car. Okay, let's see. Um, there we go. That's a little. What's going on? Right? No, we've got to insert this. Oh yes. <laughs> just, this is the big part. I'll just snap it on. Who cares about that thing that we were just working on? All right. 
Yes, Brickanista. Oh my goodness gracious. So check this out. It was out. so hard. We tried so hard. Check this out, y'all. So now the decoration that we made on the side wow fits in with the window i think that's and, pretty cool and i think you can see these colors match here what we're seeing here is next to that medium azure a dark purple with dark purple translucent um shield that's so cool that is very really cool what would we say? Werner Panton. It is sort of Werner Panton. If you from don't the, know from who the that 60s, is, look Google up. It. Yeah, look up See? Werner Panton. Now this is what's uh, this is what'll be awesome when we get the website up and running is that Thanks, you will Johnny be Cat. able to go to this episode's write up on the on the website and we'll ha and there will be links to all the stuff we talked about, the pictures of Starsky and Hutch and pictures of the Duke boys. Johnny Cat corrected and... me. He he got it right. He says Starsky had the brown hair, Hutch was the blonde. And of course, David Soul was also in Salem's Lot, a terrible Stephen King movie that I love. Yeah, I love well, like the Lot. original version, right? With yeah, with David Soul. That's when you were talking yeah. about. Yeah. Okay. All right. So now we're gonna use this. Oh nope. What are we doing? Eventually, we're gonna do that, and we need one of those uh, coral. Now here's a piece. Does anybody know what those? Um, we're throwing out some highfalutin design names. Werner Panton. Yeah, actually, I know. Werner Panton. Well, I'm glad big... people recognized him. I mean, we grew up in the 70s, so Werner Panton, like, I came home from summer camp one year, and my parents had painted a big, like, Werner Panton, like, swooshy thing around my bedroom. Uh, and I thought yeah. it was really cool. And at the time, of course, I had no idea what a Werner Panton was. But yeah. And actually, honestly, I didn't really know that name until um, a few years ago when Richard brought it up to me um, when I was working on those pieces for Comic-Con. Oh, yeah, because we wanted big swooshy color for yeah. Candyland, yep, right? Yeah, for Candyland. Yeah, and, he, and we talked about Werner Panton. And if you really want to go there with colorful plastic, you can talk about Massimo Vignelli with, um, with the Heller... Um, stackable colored plastic plates. Oh, and well, stuff we like have that. some of those. We do. And one of, of our Lego trays is a uh, Massimo Vignelli <laughs> yellow yellow plastic tray. Okay, we have now officially lost the thread. All right. <laughs> so um, anyway, I was asking earlier. Does anybody know like what do we what do you call these ones? I, we all, again. We have our own Lego language, and we always call this. I'm like, you know, that piece that they use on the modular buildings. That's exactly. And I'm what I sure said. there's a shorter way to say it than and, like, you know, a paragraph. Well, it has even a longer name for us. You know, that piece they use in the modular buildings that only has half as many studs, <laughs> so you can easily remove the other floor. That's the name of it. <laughs> oh, like oh, oh, uh oh! I'm writing these down. Geo Ponti. And Alexander Gerard. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oop. Dirt, you're shaking. All right. I love looking up stuff like that. So it looks like. We... Oh, Doc Sampson says Moto knows about them. Uh oh, we're getting highfalutin. Well, up in I mean, you know, it's funny though because we really do like. I, it, you know they say that like nothing is new, right? But yeah. and but like so many of the the designs and stuff you see now were influenced by, um, you know, ba you know Bauhaus or Art Nouveau yeah. or Art Deco. Well, we used classical art as a big influence for our um, movie mashup build on Lego Masters. Yeah. And I actually talked about it, but they didn't actually show it on screen, because I'm sure they thought everyone yeah. would think it was boring. But what what episode was that? That was the movie mashup one. No, uh, do you know what number? I was don't remember. Four? I don't remember. It's all a blur two, at this two point. Two was explosion. It might have been three or something. But we talk okay. about we talk about our design process in our YouTube video on on oh, that episode. Okay, so and, check it out. Yep. Yeah. Oh, are you ready? Oh, I was Were just gonna say, to say we we drew from Gustave Doré and and Hieronymus Bosch, but with many figures. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. What is it? Who do we say? We call them one, one by, by four, four jumper. wide jumpers. But they're not jumpers, though. That's the no, thing. No, because it's they, all the, in, it's system. in the system. It's a just... one by four with two studs. Plate. Oh, of course. Paul Sinison. That sounds right to me. 
plate modified one by four with two studs without groove. That's longer than what we call it. I know, but doesn't that, <laughs> if you have to order it on Bricklink, everything is a plate modified. It is. There are so many plate modified. Uh -oh, okay, so a long time ago, there. we added these um, these click hinge insides to the side of the bus. And oh, then yeah. you'll remember that we built uh -oh. in... Oops, sorry, Melody. We built in these, um, these little click hinge pieces on this part. So this is going to go... Let's see if I can do this without, without breaking, breaking it. it. There, there we go. That works pretty well. And this now folds up like this and provides a little, like, And thing. everything fits perfectly. What happens on the outside? Look at that. Smooth. Look how cool that is, right? Smooth. And then this, this ledge design here can just rest against the side wall. That's great. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, so this, and there's So this stuff. can open up and then this flops down. And I think that's probably Unikitty's little dance You know, you could something. almost say that it pops open. You could. I wonder if something's going to pop up. <laughs> something's going to pop up. Um, okay. Okay, more things now? Do more we move this builds. off to the sides? Oh, we're making a disco ball, everybody. It's not really a ball, but it's a disco Thing. cube. Duck? <laughs> it's a disco. Oh, how dare you. I'm sorry, everyone. Not, not so not, flat one by four Do plate. not expose yourself <laughs> to disco duck, whatever you do. Do not look it up. Do not <laughs> listen to it. Many think, Chick, you are right. Calling one by one bricks cubes isn't accurate either. We're not so worried about accuracy. I mean, I but like I think to know. Jump, I, think, I, I, I just know. think for me, calling that a jumper would be confusing. Yeah, that's just for me. Um, every obviously everybody has their own their own little Lego Where can language. I, put them? I don't want them to be in the way, but I want them to be in the shot. <laughs> you don't want them to be in the way, but you want them to be in the way. <laughs> okay, right. I'm, I'm just gonna put. Unikitty in the pop-up party bus. Okay, so now we're making another, like, tile decoration. No, I'm going to be in the way. I know. Okay. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna. So now we're going to take that inverse gray thing that has the, yeah. the peg sticking out of it, right? So it's got studs on the top part. No Hieronymus Bosch Lego I mock ideas or... <laughs> no, that would be terrifying. I don't think there should be. Well, I gotta say, I only took... Um, uh, it was... Uh, the piece was The Temptation of St. Anthony, where all of these like bad guys are like flying up and trying to pull on his beard and tug on his clothes and, and pulling in the other direction. I think it was Bosch, but it almost feels like uh, Bruegel. Bruegel. Um, <laughs> Right, because it wasn't right it wasn't quite so surreal, but the creatures were surreal, and I just wanted these minifigures flying around, you know, the bad um, the bad fairy in our movie mashup um, to be like that cloud of. All right, ones Mr. From Art Etching. Degree. Well, I don't very say fancy. I don't say art with a capital A, <laughs> yes. but I like I like references, right? I like to go back and see what amazing things were made before. We we do a lot of that. We use photo references. Oh, all the time. It's it's a huge. Actually, um, just last night, um, we uh, we were digging through some papers and found our original drawing, like our concept drawings for. Um, Treasure hey, Corey, the, yeah, it the is. Snake queen. Yeah, our oh, Treasure hey, of the Corey, Snake Queen. And we actually posted them up um, uh, on our Patreon for our, for our Patreon folks. A little behind-the-scenes stuff. It was really it was really fun. Oh, it is going to be a little, like, almost disco ball. Yep. So the 2x2 two two round brick goes in there. 2x2 two two round. And here you go. Now, if you want to know how to make... Um, I'm just going to guess. Yeah, how to make a Lego cube that has studs on all sides except for the bottom. That's how you do it. A combination of snot um, uphangs. You want to show that up close? And snot downhangs. So It'll be a little out of focus, sorry. So you can see that I've used... Um, is that in there? forward. Forward. There you go. Oh my goodness. Sorry there. Bear with us. You know what? Here, you're gonna do this. Here. I'm. I'm not doing that. That's silly. There, that's better. So that's two uphang snot brackets. Hi, dear John. It's on nice on there. either side of the bottom of the two by two round. And then I'm going to attach. Just show one of them. Yeah. This bracket on top, and then another one on the other side. 
Oh, so Joshua Steele says, Richard, there's a Death Star Escape Lego set, and I have it, and I will send you pictures and videos of play functions and minifigures. Oh, that. that would be awesome. That would be awesome. Okay, I so was looking up Star Wars mocks to make, um, and and the other one I really wanted to make was the carbon freezing chamber, but that's so, like, that's really familiar territory, well, they too. Well, they make that piece. And that was a nice. set, right? And then when we were looking at Ewok Adventureland, there's such a cute Ewok village as well. Yeah. And I go... Uh, Lego yeah, Star great, Wars. That's like one of the Holy Grail sets. For it's a happened lot of a lot. It's it was huge and really expensive. If I if I, um, Paul asked who is Dear John. Uh, actually, so, so, um, a lot of the tattoos I have are based on um old sailor tattoos from the forties and fifties, and Dear John was um, you know, a Dear John letter was when you were like away, um. And your girlfriend sends you a letter to break up with you, and they called it like generically a, a, dear, a dear John, John letter. letter. Um, and then yeah, so, JB, you're right. So the little it's a little, little sailor guy here. I guess I'll show it. It's this little sailor guy, and he's got um, he's reading the letter, and, and he's his cry, heart's He's broken. crying, and his heart's broken. <laughs> it's very funny. I always sometimes with the kids I teach will be like, why is he so sad? <laughs> like, why is he crying? I was like, oh dear, have to go there. Um, so yeah, so it's the same all the way around. It's just uh, yellow in one corner, blue. So Here, yellow, blue, pink, pink. Yellow. Well, that's, mm -hmm. that's yellow and blue. I've just decided to do it my mm -hmm. own way. No, are the you serious? Oh my goodness! I think goodness. we can all agree, everyone. No, that I the can't. Instructions. Okay, as need a to happen. thirty year lighting designer, I can't redesign the lights on the pop up party bus. When you redesign the lights in our <laughs> living room, then you may redesign the lights on the pop up party bus. I was thinking about Disco our ball. set behind us. Like, I think it needs a little more pizzazz. <laughs> <laughs> we might make a more exciting set behind us. Okay, so then we're going to get to... Oh, look, I, I put blue. four tiles on and then I gave up. <laughs> Wait, is it not yellow on the other side? No, it's just the top is too blue okay. and too pink. All right, and then we're going to attach this. So we have our spinning, uh, we have our spinning disco ball. And that spins because gray makes friction-free pins. No, no friction on a gray pin. So it doesn't actually show where it goes. Oh, it pops up. I'm not even kidding. Look. Oh, right, because it fits into those okay. little... We got it. It fits right into there. these little clips, right? Right there. It goes here, and... It pops up. That is pretty awesome, I gotta say. And of course, it fits right in with the the decoration, you know, on the top here. Oops, moved it other way. Here on the top, pretty cool. Um, and is I that see a real hinges. difference between the colored pins? Um, the colored pins. Well, um, yes. And now I'm gonna get this wrong. But a black Technic pin has friction. Oh, yeah. And if you put it in a pinhole, it'll hold its position to a greater or less degree. It has friction. But a gray one, and I think a blue one, correct me on this, Paul Sinison or someone else, Holly someone, um, I think a blue one and a and a um, gray one are frictionless. And then the tan ones are frictionless, but black has black friction. Black friction one. There's Wait, friction, blue yeah. has friction too? Now I have to try it. No, black is friction, and then the other one is not friction. So blue is not. I don't think so. So everyone, um, I am going to I'm going to um, pop, pop back over here. It's actually 11:40, so it's time for what? us to finish up for the day. But we've got two more bags to go that I know we will finish up tomorrow. Um, we will finish up on the the pop up party bus. I'm very excited, and um, and darn it, we are going to put the darn stickers on it tonight. I am I'm making I'm calling it. We are going to do this tonight. So um, okay, let me just settle this question here for myself, if you would. I don't mean to interrupt. Sorry about that. I'm interrupting. I know. Okay. So right here, a gray pin, no friction at all. Black pin, lots of friction. Tan pin, no friction at all. 
Awesome. Right, settled that question once and for all. All right, everybody, we are going to wrap it up for today. I just want to thank everybody so much for joining us. Um, as you know, you can find us on the Instagrams at uh, at Tricky Bricks on Instagram. And up there we post uh, pictures of mocks that we do and little things. So if you're interested yep. in seeing what our work looks like, um, you can check, uh, you can check that check out. Come check us out. Um, you can email us at flynn at trickybricks.com. Don't forget about the building challenge. Um, no, do by and when? Everything is, yeah, do by the end of the stream tomorrow. All of the information is in the description down there. Uh, if you want to send us a, a snail mail, which Hooray! we love, Yay, by the way, snail mail. Uh, we love getting letters and stuff like that from people. We've gotten, we already got a great one from Noobmaster69. And you use him as a pointer. <laughs> Excuse me. So you can P.O. Box us at Flynn and Richard, P.O. Box 11517, Oakland, Oakland California, 94611. He's upside down. I know. So finally, <laughs> uh, finally, I wanted to say um, you can, uh, we just launched our Patreon where we've got um, stickers and special stuff for our Patreon subscribers. And you can find us on Patreon at that www.patreon.com tricky bricks or if you just want to do um if you're interested in doing a one-time thing you can get us on venmo again all the information on how to contact us and all the various different places are down at the bottom Ooh, oh i gotta take cut a bite out of crime take and, a bite out of crime and moto's keeping me on the up and up here the the blue pin he says the blue pin does have friction i don't know i tried it in this hole and it has friction i was going too fast Blue and black, yes. Gray and tan, no. And and so don't forget, everybody, we are going to be starting to build the Stranger Things set this Sunday in our I'm regular so time excited. slot with special guests. We are going to have special guests, some of them, some of which I will announce, but we are having one mystery guest. Who you could it be? You will have to tune in to find out who it's going to be. Yeah, if you're not but, here um, Sunday. But I can tell you for sure, Boone is going to be here. Um, Holly is going to be here. Um, yep. We've got a few other guests um, on the line um, as well. Yes, McGruff. The <laughs> Take a bite out of crime. Yes. Um, so, yeah, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Don't forget to tune in. So I wanted to say thank you, everybody, so much for joining us today. We really appreciate it. We always enjoy hanging out <laughs> and talking with y'all. We have a lot of fun um, together. Yeah, we definitely do have a lot of fun. Thank you so much. And we will see you next time for part four of the Pop-Up Party Pop Bus. Pop-Up Party Bus. All right. Bye, Bye. everyone.